Good morning, it's Friday. I was given this story, shown this story yesterday, and I thought it was worth posting. It goes on to say, A father said, his do- said to his daughter, You graduate of honours. Here is a car that I acquired many years ago. It is several years old. But before I give it to you, take it to the used car lot downtown and tell him I want to sell it and see how much they offer you. The daughter went to the used car lot, returned to her father and said, well, they offered me a thousand dollars because it looks very worn out. The father said, well, take it to the pawn shop. So the daughter went to the pawn shop, returned to her father and said, well, the pawn shop offered a hundred dollars because it says, they say it looks a very old car. The father said to his daughter, well, go to the car club and show them the car. The daughter took the car to the club and turned and told her father, some people in the club offered $100,000 for it it, since it is a Nissan Skyline R34, an iconic car and sought after by many. The father said to his daughter, I wanted you to know that the right place values you the right way. If you are not valued, do not be angry. It means you're in the wrong place. Those who know your value are those who appreciate you. Never stay in a place where no one sees your value. In Matthew chapter 6, verse 26, we read, Look at the birds of the air. They do not sow or reap or store away in barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not more valuable than they? And reading from 1 Samuel, chapter 16. But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not look on his appearance or on height or his stature, because I have rejected him. For the Lord sees not as people see. People look on the outward appearance, but the Lord looks on the heart. Today I want you to be reminded that you are valued by God. This is the right place to be in God's loving embrace. So if you've walked away from God, I invite you to come back. Come back to the right place, to the place where you are valued and appreciated and accepted for who you are. Not what you look like, not what you do, but for who you are. God bless you on this day.